In this video, I'm going to show you something neat that you can do out of Trips Tight End with the new Calvin Johnson uh, receiver card. You can also do this with an outside apprentice, um, but Calvin Johnson gets wide receiver apprentice for one AP. We're going to show you how you can really take advantage of that with a specific setup here out of the Trips Tight End formation. If you want to get my entire Trips Tight End offensive ebook, make sure that you join my Patreon. Uh, the link to do that is in the description for just 10 bucks. It'll get you access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks. I have, um, I think I have 12 offensive and defensive ebooks as of today, and we're working on releasing uh, a brand new offensive ebook this week uh, for you guys. So if you want to check all that stuff out, again, the link is down in the description. Okay, so the play that we're going to be taking a look at today is Pat's White In. Um, you could do this out of any play in the formation, uh, but Pat Swayan has the, one of the best out routes in the game as well. And I'll actually show, um, I'm going to put Mike Evans here and Chris Dalton here to show you the power of this out route whenever you have like short and elite or some kind of route running ability. So what you'll see here is I'm just going to clear out this left side and I want you to watch this out route you'll see a lot of times this out route will basically just get wide open you might get d-line pick but you know I mean that's practice mode at this point but anyways um, you know you'll see that this this um, this out route is really 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 good okay so you see here you just isolate it you see that it gets separation and a lot of times it's gonna be an easy five to ten yards so the beauty of this out route is that you have that. Now, what we're going to show you in this video, like I said, is a, a specific little trick that I like to use um, to basically get Mike Evans a, on a C route. And if you have the wide receiver apprentice ability, um, they can have slot hot routes when he's in the slot, and they can have outside hot routes when he's outside. So I could have all my slot hot routes, for example, if I wanted to put him on you know, let's say I was running this play, I could do some routes kind of like this, you know, and I could run this play like so, and you see that we have this, this slot apprentice post route, okay? Um, or what I could also do is I could uh, put the running back on a wheel route, and then I'm just going to motion Jones, and as soon as Jones passes Mike, Mike Evans, then I can put him on a C route, and then I can block Julio Jones, and I'm getting screamed at four-man rushes, nano blitzing me here, but uh, anyway, I'll show you kind of the concept. So, you know, again, when you're running back, if you want to, put that guy outside of press C route, and you'll see that this outside of press C route gets really good separation when it's ran from the slot. Um, it actually gets better separation, in my opinion, when it's ran from you know that position so again all we're doing is we're just whenever we motion this guy it should give you the option to put this guy on an outside apprentice corner route and then what you'll see here is you see how this can just cook man-to-man -man coverage okay so you have this uh, the C route against man and then the next thing that you can do with this is your tight end your tight end um, your tight end can do whatever you want so you can do whatever you want with the rest of the play so something i like to do is this i'll put my if i have a tight end apprentice i'll put him on a corner i'm going to motion jones across and put him on a slant and then i'm going to outside apprentice c route so i'm still blocking you know my running back of course and you see how open that c route gets it's just very good whenever you motion it i've just found that it's one of the better routes in the game so now um, and again, if you don't have wide receiver apprentice, you can put your outside apprentice here if you know that you're going to do this going in. It is a little bit of a tell, um, but if you have outside apprentice, you know, then you could do do it that way as well. Just kind of, if you don't have that AP or whatever. Uh, at this point in the year, most people can get outside apprentice, and then you see how good the slant is as well. If you wanted to tag a backside slant um, I really like just a simple wheel route um, you know and then the C route right here because then I can motion block the sky off this edge which is nice this year out of trips and then I have this out route okay um, you know so real simple another thing you could do is you could kind of do a little mesh concept uh, something like this right here and then probably wheel the back you know so you can kind of freestyle a little bit out of this um, but now you have a little mesh 
concept coming across as opposed to out breaking routes, you have in breaking routes, um, something simple like that, you know, really effective uh, for beating man this year. Uh, but anyways, this is a way that you can kind of attack man in kind of a unique way because most of the time, especially if they're sitting pressure, right, they're not going to be guarding. Like if they're sitting pressure on this and you kind of have a setup that looks like looks like this defensively, let's just say. This is very popular this year. Um, you know, and they're going to be using this guy. Oftentimes, they're not going to have anybody in main coverage on the back because they, you know, are going to be sitting pressure. So when you motion this guy in and block him here, nobody's guarding the back. You also are able to pick up the blitz. Now, Mike Evans doesn't have the best route running in the world, but people with really, really good route running, you'll see, will do a really, really good job, you know, of, of being able to get open, okay? So... You know, again, that's just something to kind of take into consideration, um, you know, as you're running this offense. But again, you know, we teach you all the fine-tuning stuff in the ebooks and how they're going to adjust to you. But let's say that they have, you know, again, they're setting pressure. You got the running back on this little quick route, and then you've got that that C route and that tight end, tight end uh, apprentice, or not tight end apprentice, but tight end deep dig. Um, if you wanted to, again, you can put the tight end on anything. So if you want to put the tight end on a corner route, you can put the tight end on a corner route. If you want to put the tight end on a, a quick drag over the middle and have a have a route concept that looks like that, uh, you can do that as well. Okay. So there's so much you can do with this play. Uh, but what, what I want to stress is the power of this wheel route here real quick with you. Let me see here. Boom. No one's going the running back. I can shoot him quick to the flat maybe break a tackle and that kind of thing. So a lot you could do with this play. Um, yeah. But anyways, if you want to learn the rest of the trips tight end offense, make sure you join our Patreon. Otherwise, um, you know, use this play to beat man coverage. Real simple, uh, real effective this year. Thanks for watching. Again, if you want to watch or get the whole ebook, uh, you can click the link in the description to join our Patreon page. Uh, Ten bucks will get you access to all the material over there.